Welcome back to the channel guys, it's your boy Aylin and we are back today with another video man. So we coming at y'all with another shoe review today. This shoe recently came out, I think I believe um, two weeks ago, but shipping took like a week and a half, two weeks to get here man. I don't know what was good with Champs and their shipping system. But yeah, it got here like a week or two later. But before we get into the video, if you guys are new to the channel, go down there and hit that subscribe button. I think we just hit 1.2k subscribers. So thank you for everybody for showing love. Leave a like, leave a comment, and we're gonna continue to grow, man. We're gonna continue to grow. So make sure y'all join the crew, baby. I need to come up with a name for y'all, man. I'm thinking Lynn Dynasty, because we're gonna be in this for a long time. You feel me? For the long haul, you feel me? But without further ado, let's hop into the review, man. All right, so incoming today, we have a Jordan 3 box. As you guys can see, the Jumpman is orange. I'm a little colorblind. I don't know, that thing looks orange, but I just feel like it's kind of yellow to me, man. I'm red and green colorblind, so I, my, my colors is a little bit out of whack. You feel me? But yeah, as you guys can see, it is a size nine uh, women's or seven and a half men's. And yeah, it's the women's Jordan 3 retro as you guys know from the title and let's get into the unboxing so big shout out to my boy anthony fordham my boy ant he be holding it down with these releases like he he uh runs it for me sends it ships it to my house big shout out to you man and if you're watching this video you already know all love brody but yeah let's get into it he's held it down for retail too all right as you guys can see open the box regular jordan 3 elephant print paper on top elephant print box on the outside and yeah boom so first glance at the shoe you know what i'm saying in my opinion this is a very clean jordan 3 i don't know about y'all but i feel like yo if you got the white cement colorway and you throw in any color you can't go wrong with it yeah like you're throwing in orange jordan never played on on uh, like a bright orange team before like the unc threes was um a good shoe good looking shoe i have those in the back should have grabbed them for um, a comparison but oh well white cement three colorway co uh, color blocking orange replacing the black but without further ado let's hop into the b-roll so you guys can see the full details of the shoe and we'll be back with the breakdown Right, man so coming back from the b-roll as you guys can see like i said it is a jordan 3 um white cement color blocking with orange uh jordan brand has been coming out with this new thin leather tongue for some reason and it makes the shoe look sleeker but personally i'm a fan of the fat tongue as you guys can see on the black cement threes so here's just a comparison um, next to the black cement threes. As you guys see, the tongue on the black cement threes is fatter and has that more cushioning. While on the laser orange threes, the tongue is very thin. And a lot of the new Jordans coming out, they have this thin tongue for some reason. And I don't know, man, let me know if you guys like it. I personally, I'm personally a fan of the, the fatter tongue in the past. But yeah, not, not really much to say. Elephant print right here, elephant print in the back. Uh, tumble leather on the upper midsole midsole is white and orange jordan jump in on the back in black and then the bottom has the orange accents with the stars and yeah everything like that so when this shoe first surfaced on the internet i just looked at it i'm like okay it's pretty clean it's like another jordan 3 coming out um they've been pushing out a good amount of jordan 3s this year not gonna lie to you guys and i don't know I don't know if Jordan 3s is coming back. I know Jordan 4s is definitely coming back for sure. Like they've been doing so many collabs and just like people out of nowhere, they just been hitting me up about like Jordan 4s. Like, yeah, I used to clown Jordan 4s. Now y'all like Jordan 4s? Come on, man. Come on, man. But yeah, man, when this first surface the internet, I thought it was a pretty clean shoe. But having it in hand, I definitely, definitely 
like it a lot more. Even though it is a woman's shoe, I do plan on picking up a pair for myself. I'm a fan of the, like the contrast, like it goes black into the orange, white, you know, it's, it's just, it just looks clean, you feel me? Like, uh, even though summer is ending, this is more of a summer shoe. And I do have the white cement threes as well. So I have the UNC threes, the white cement threes, and I'm probably gonna pick up a pair of these for myself. Um, I apologize, I don't have my size on hand right now. So I won't be able to bring a on foot. But yeah, that's um, everything covered in the shoe. Here's the other shoe just to show you guys another look. And yeah, man, that should be wrapping up this video. Let me know what you guys feel about the shoe down in the comments down below. Um, another thing, before we wrap up the video, sizing. For Jordan 3s, I go true to size, size nine. Um, myself, Jordans do feel a little bit big, so you could go down half a size if you want a more tighter fit. But I suggest going true to size on Jordan 3s. And yeah, man, let me know how you guys feel about the shoe down below in the comments should i pick up a pair if you have a pair let me know and leave a like man and comment down below what else y'all want to see on the channel and this is your boy a lynn i'm checking out and y'all make sure y'all stay safe and stay swaggy man your boy is out